Last time, Magnus and Lou was able to like talk to the people of the town and learn about and learn about different town folk. Now we will see what they are doing and they will continue the investigation kind of sort of not really. They will conclude the date the, f the first actual investigation though. Yeah, Thomas, don't cry. Me don't, and Lou love you. We love you. Don't cry. Okay, now we can go on to the... Now we can actually have the first chapter finished. Yay! Okay, back to the investigation. We need to solve this one quickly. Let's see here's the key thing. Here we can look inside. All right, what time is it? Oh wait, is oh wait. He said his shop was gonna open tomorrow, so it's not gonna be open now. Uh, Let's just go back to the hotel. Wait, give George a flower. Wait, George home. I see your point. That would be the absolute best thing to do. Okay, I think. I think George lives in the second part of town, close to the gas station. I want to say so. I think the second part of town is over here, isn't it? It's where it's artillery stuff. Okay, yes. Yeah. And, and apparently George is already home, so let's just go to his house. That's where you go. Okay, so we just need to take this highway, which we are currently here. Okay, so if we just stay on the highway we're currently on, we should be fine. Okay. Let's go. Until we get to the city. Oh, We're still no. low on health. Hopefully we get our health back between chapters. That'd be lovely. I swear this game's fun, but it has that aspect where it's like... It's, I, I, I see what you're getting at, but I, I kind of like the world exploring in a way. Well, I mean, yeah, it kind of seems fun, but I mean... When you're a freaking person that don't get much freaking sleep and you sit here, it's like, oh god. Man, I do see that point. Okay, oh well. It's where it's like he is talking to the players and he's like, if you notice anything, just stop me. I know! But I wonder if that, if Zach has to have actual some other connection too. Yeah, instead of just the player. I wonder who Zach is to him actually. Let's have to find out as the story progresses. I know. I mean, I just want to find out more about the story, and I want to like. Well, the thing is, the story actually is getting unfolded by doing these random side bits too. I think the, they the should have made it a main thing, though. I mean, it. Well, I'm pretty sure to fully enjoy the experience of this game, you probably should do everything. It's probably one of those type of games where, honestly, you really probably should put the effort to try to do everything. I didn't the first time I played it, but I did still have fun, a lot of fun with it the first time I played it. I'm going to double check to make sure that shop ain't open either, but actually, before I do that, let's go check George. I think he's down this way. Let me just make sure. I think I'm going the right way. Alright, need down map. There you go. Take a left and he's right there. Okay. Take left into the street. Gotcha. Whoa, hang on. It's like really hard to stay comfortable on this couch. I really noticed that. It's kind of awkward. That sucks too. Okay. Alright, well, I, we try to make dinner an uplifting experience, George. I'm sorry about that. But let, let's go ahead and uh, see if we can have you as a friend now. Agent Morgan. Far as no name. Only blossoms with any. 
Okay. Uh, George, here it is. The nameless flower. Awesome. Did you Morgan? No need to thank me. I did this on my own during my private hour. Tell your mother I hope she gets mm -hmm. well soon. Yeah, I'll do that. This will make her feel at least a little better. I sure hope so. I really do. I got a radio. It takes a radio. Take this. It's an emergency police radio. Hmm. If you're ever in trouble, use it. And I'll be right there. Thank you, George. Cool. Ah. That's neat. Now, Agent Morgan, don't take this the wrong way. It's not an emotional thank you gift for helping me with my mother. <laughs> giving me this so we can do our jobs more smoothly, that's all. Why didn't you give me this before? Name of flower completed. Yay! Yay! We got a, ra a radio to make our jobs much smoother. And it will make our jobs much smoother. How? Well, I'll randomly drive by the thing and then I'll probably show you how the thing works. I want you to the panda shop. I don't know if the panda shop will count until. I don't even know if it'll be open yet, but I want to try. Dang it. As soon as I figure out how to drive. It's probably something I ought to learn how to do. Because honestly. Yeah. I mean, this well, is 80%. He's a horrible driver. This is like 80% of the game and also like 60% like, of the game. Seriously, life. it's like 80% of the game that you literally have to drive around. Oh, it seems like it. It's the world map. It's basically like an RPG world oh, map. Oh my goodness. This is an RPG game. I'm not going to get to play anything. I'll let you play the thing I was actually going to do myself while I'll let you play. It's a side quest. Because I've right. not even been able to touch the controller, except for one time. Oh, it's open. Except for one time I've only been able to touch the controller today. Well, I'll let you touch the controller here in a minute. And, and I mean, you could do some of this if you want to. I still think you want to. No, because honestly, I thought there was going to be more action levels than this. There will be. There's still a lot of action levels. Alright, hello Weasley. There are quests for us, I see. Hmm. Is there anything you want? I've come to see what you're selling. You have a really good reputation. Don't trust what you hear out there. The information can totally be controlled this day and age. Hmm. I'm all well aware of that. But I can smell the difference. It's important in my line of work. Information smells bad when it's fake. And my shot smells okay, doesn't it? Something like that. Wait, do you take pride in your work? John's a tool for killing. It isn't a job to brag about. But any job needs pride in it for it to be done well. That's what I think. A mixture of humility and pride. That's the way up. That's the way to be, alright? Looks like my nose is right, Zach. Let's talk to you. You've got quite a selection here. I wonder if people come from all around. Well, I thought he was going to look at the freaking gun. He, he said he had a quest, so I want to look at his quest. Other than to admire the results. The words of a true craftsman. Your job must be your hobby. No, I have another hobby. You do? Aside from work. Tell me, Ted, what is it? It's nothing special. Since I was a kid, I always liked to collect cards. Cards? Like trading cards? Trading cards. Right. I mean, like the cards would be collected? I got this one after I came to this town. Hmm. This is a precious one. Where did you get it? I picked it up around here somewhere. I didn't really think much of it. I see. Then how about a trade? A trade? Hmm. Here's an idea. As a collector, I just love looking at rare cards. I'd love to take a look at the cards you have. I won't take them from you. <laughs> and I'll give you something, depending on how many you show me. You'll huh. pay me just to look at my cards. You really must be a card freak, huh? <laughs> Beginner collector, start. We found a new quest. Will you show me your cards? Sure. Of course. Of course. Here are my cards. You got more than any. I 
I've never seen any of them before. I hmm. appreciate you showing them to me. Awesome. Just a little something, as promised. Yay! We got another card. <laughs> well, that's 200 more bucks in the bank. If you find any new cards, come and show them to me, will you? Yay! We did it. We completed the quest. Amateur collector start. I want to view the list. Oh. <laughs> Yay! Oh god! Extra for slide missions. Hmm. Okay, now let's actually look at his shop. Oh my goodness! Finally, is it the same freaking thing? It's the same thing. That's technically why I didn't really want to look at it that much. I think he gets the gun. If you lose your gun, you could probably come here and get it. Strangely enough, the funny thing is, the more important thing from him is the fact that you can totally show him your cards and get items. For it. So I need to collect those cards. That's what the cards are for. For everyone who's been wondering, that's what the cards are for. So for that quest, you get items. Why was I about? And I'm like half right, now, now let's go ahead. And, now let's go ahead. Because I was almost going to be like Leo. You're an idiot. I am not Leo. I know Leo is here. I am not him. Mm. Side. Apparently, I'm just getting you May. confused. They were gone. Okay, a radio. This walkie-talkie will bring you back to the facility you visited. Alright, let's use. Okay. Where do we want to go? We have the sheriff department, the hospital. For some reason I can't use this for some reason. That's weird. If we go basically anywhere we visited. Isn't that nice? So basically right now we want to go to the hotel. Yay! Okay, when we get to the action? Shortly, because after this, after the chapter starts, I'll take you to a side thingy. And then probably soon after that, will probably actually be a level. I want it to be a level. Well, it's a side level. I it's a, it's a, as a side level with Zambies. I don't want you a are, side level. I want a main level. You want the side level. I promise. You want the side level. I'll show you why I won't get there. If you don't want the main side level, I'll take it. So I can shoot Zambi since I haven't had a chance to shoot Zambi. You've not had a chance. I don't want to take that away from you. Okay. Why does make going through town a lot easier if you want to just go to certain locations? Okay, here we go. We're going to make our report now. Okay, then, Zach. Let's go back over our problems. Let's actually begin solving the case. That weird uh, thing. Do you remember what that was? Uh, yeah, it was a. Uh, it was a red seed. That's right. We found the same red seed in her. I swear it's almost like for Zach. Mhm. Mm hmm. Why is his voice so low? I don't know. Why is the voice so low in this game? I swear. We almost need to knock the everything else down to like 10 in order for the voice to be heard. Mm -hmm. Okay. Pink grass. Oh, wait. I know what it was. It was the stiletto heel. Bandage fed, bondage fetish restraints. Yes, yeah, totally. Dude, yeah. you almost yeah. ran out of time. I know. I was just laughing at the second option because it seems silly. Mm-hmm. 
those being a perpetrator who came on it. That'd be lovely. because it was something round. He is very problematic, rich, and eccentric in Harry. It took him four days because we got murdered by ourselves almost. I'm confused. Why does he feel sad after looking at a girl's back? I don't know. He's obviously straight. Since he keeps hanging out with he keeps sitting closer to the girl. Which is obvious and it's fine. But we're still gonna hit on Thomas for obvious reasons because we are not straight. So mm -hmm. I don't know. Number 1506. Yay! We did it. Oh look, it's that one scene where we smacked that thing. <laughs> Remember that one random scene? Where we smacked that thing with a good whack? God, I'm just trying to get your name wrong tonight. That's why here. Episode 1 cleared. We got an Achievo. Yay. Oh, hello. Wait, what? That's a, that's a weird Jeff face loading screen again. Oh, get the battery. Oh, we're back in heaven again. Or dream to hell. Isaac Turner. Angel. Are you thirsty? Are you there, baby? You must be very thirsty. Um, why? You Coffee with milk. That's all. Um, I 
pick one then, I'm sure. I drank a vodka earlier. Hello, Anna. Um, Why are you pouring this coffee with milk? What is a weird dream? Ow, oh, my thigh. You like need it very hard. Oh, hello. Who are you? My name is Becky. Hmm. Hello, Becky. Oh, my friend. What are you doing here? My name is Becky. Becky Ann's oh, and his friend. My name My is Becky. <laughs> I think we get that. Is your throat is clenched? You must do what you must do. Solve this case? Take a sip of coffee and go. Um. No, I was actually wondering when that one is going to pop up in your head. When I guess when we had. Between chapters, he's gonna pop up. Oh, the door's open. Can we move yet? I guess so. Oh, and everything's gone, of course. That makes no sense. Oh, that was the chocolate chip cookie. Yes. This is going to be amazing at the fact that they were totally taking to the real world. <laughs> what if we get a chocolate chip cookie? We'll straight up be like that. It'll be amazing. <laughs> Hi. Let's open this door. I don't love you. Ah. I thought you loved me. Oreos. The cookie? Yeah. Hmm. I'm tasty. I want some Oreos. What do you think of I me? Mean, like an actual person named Oreo? I don't know. I don't even know anybody like that. I'm confused. Okay, we have a weird room. There's a child and a mannequin. Obviously, let's check out this man. Nothing. You. What happened? Wait, what happened? What happened? Go back. What? No. No! When what happened? Stop. The, 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 when what happened? No! He woke up. No! We gotta wait till the next chapter. We need to shave. What a gosh, we need to shave. But he looks sexy. Facial hair is sexy. This case looks like it's directly related to us. And I do not know how yet. And I do know I need some coffee. Oh, we need coffee, sir. George said he'd have someone pick us up in the parking lot. Hmm. Let's get some breakfast with Polly first. That was a good idea. And we're ready. Yay, we actually have full health now, yay. Okay, so I'll watch my picture. Uh. Okay, so the little kid. Hello there. Did you need something? No, I was just passing by. I didn't Hello. think anybody else was here. It was Polly. The door opened like that. Just it surprised me. That's all. <laughs> Thank you. Forest Kaysen, sapling salesman. Hmm. Hello, Doc. I'm Kaysen, Forest Kaysen. Nice to meet cool. you. I travel a whole lot, you see, selling tree saplings. Just the usual salesman doing the usual road trip. Sometimes I feel, I don't know, like a jolly old bumblebee spreading pollen. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. I get it. You're the special agent Scarface that everyone's yakking about. Nice to meet you, Francis. Special agent Scarface? <laughs> you need a bigger scar to live up to that name. Call me York. That's what everyone calls me. What? You got it. York. Okay. Is this your first visit here? No, sir. Actually, I've been coming here once or twice a year for a while now. 
I don't get much business here, but it sure does make a fine vacation. Hmm. I mean, it's a gorgeous hotel at a bargain price. It's so relaxing in these parts, too. Oh, I just love all this nature. I feel so relaxed here. I wish I had a good reason to take vacation here. Hello, doggy. Say hi to Willie. Oh, don't worry. He's a good boy. Do you like dogs? He's pretty smart, too. Ooh, hmm. Before I forget, let me give you this. It's just a sample of what I sell. Thank you. I'll try to So, what brings the old FBI out here? Sounds like more than just a vacation. A murder, actually. The perpetrator is still out there. Try to stay indoors at night during the rain. We want to prevent it from happening again, okay? Oh, it's a darn shame. Places like this used to be the safest in America. Good idea. Well, you know a lot of seeds? Gardening, huh? You don't look like a green thumb, but let me tell you, though. Hmm. I'm pretty much the only one who can make those saplings sprout. And there's well. a trick to it that can't really be passed on, you know? It's like, oh, the secret of making a good smoked ham, something like that. But you know, once they sprout, you don't need to do much. You can leave it be, and why, it'll turn into a big tree no matter what happens. Wow. Kind of like those stocks that politicians buy that just keep growing and growing. Well, you just wait and see. This town is going to love it. Well, <laughs> we were just about to go take the morning. Two. Also, I'll get I wonder why your name is so large. Thanks. Because there's two dudes on the screen. Yes, totally. And because you're still almost pregnant. Do you remember what the guy said? Ten minutes. Forrest Kaysen. F. Oh, Forrest Kaysen. F.K. This show has just begun. He's, just, he's related to this case somehow? Oh, what was you saying? Hmm. I wonder what type of seed makes these trees. No! What was you saying? Oh, and I was also saying maybe also because we're still trying to make it slightly. Okay. Only kind of. Well, mostly. So it's probably that. I mean, I'm sitting here in my underwear. Yeah, to the breakfast machine. Slam! There we go. Breakfast part two. Breakfast looks as good as yesterday's. And by yesterday's, I mean like. I hope you enjoy it. Wait. I will. Four days ago? Thank you. I just met Kaysen, actually. Ah, oh, good old Mr. Kaysen. Did he give you a sapling? As a matter of fact, he did. Don't tell me he gives one to everyone he meets. No, no. Only to the people he feels comfortable with. He told me. He must hmm. feel really comfortable with me. He hmm. must. Is there anyone he hasn't given the sapling to? Mustard? Okay, I'll just get it from the kitchen then. No, mustard has nothing to do with it. <laughs> I was wondering if you know of anyone that isn't didn't give a sapling to. Hmm. Oh, too much pepper. I did think it might be. I'm sorry. Hmm. Wow. Well. Forest Kaysen is hiding something. You think so too, right, Zach? But no need to rush. Probably. All the secrets are hidden until they are inevitably divulged. Yes. The powers of entropy. The powers of the world exposes something. everything and causes chaos. Just like this comic. FK again. Go 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 go. Okay, now we're basically ready. We have full everything. Now we can adventure onward. You keep quiet all of a sudden. 
to go out slowly so we don't scare whoever's waiting for us. It might be Thomas. Come on, Thomas. Oh, I was just sitting here. But, technically, one thing I was thinking of was, where was that, where's that lady that was with, um... That's a good question. Where is that lady? Who is that lady? And what's the lady deal with? What's the deal with that lady? Hmm. It's, she had high heels. Oh, it's just it's Good morning, George. Good morning. Did you sleep well? Good morning, George. Dreamland was quite nice. You do look well rested. Oh, I was up practically all night in the paperwork. Thomas helped me out, so I was able to go home and get some. Uh, no! You got down to the town late last night. Yeah. We should give her a visit. Which means going to the art gallery, correct? Yes. She lives and works in the office there. So it's the only place to find her. The gallery is open from 10 to 1700. Okay, well, it's raining, so I guess we can't do anything else. I know. Of course. Yeah, look at that face. Yes, best smile. I, I swear the smile from the Okay, hang on. Eyes. You know, let's actually get it. You know, you know, my stop this recording that I know. Okay, well, hold on. Let's do this little cutscene first. The gallery is called Muses Gallery. The Muses were the nine daughters of the goddess of memory hmm. in Greek mythology. Uh, oh, wow. Just like Diane debated that way. Is she that intelligent a woman? Oh, uh, maybe. You'll see for yourself soon enough. Okay. Did you see how Emily reacted, Zach? I sense that this Diane is not popular among other women. Dun, dun, dun. The gallery is on the north side of town. Take the road along the lake and go north. Alright. Oh, we pause. Okay. Let's okay. Recording here. Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. Well, that's all for this video. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Also, click the sword at the bottom for it to be taken to our channel and view some more videos. I also want to subscribe for further updates and stuff of that nature. Also, um, comment down below about anything you'd like to see us do in this game. Anything else? And see me be more amazing and complaining. Yes, exactly. Because apparently Magnus wanted to complain a lot during this game. A lot. And even though this is actually a good game. At least I think so. Alright, bye-bye.